Okay, so outdoor activities, learning opportunities, a state of the art planetarium, not a lot of places you can get all of those things except for in Kingsport at Bays Mountain uh, Park. It has something for everyone. Absolutely. Animal lovers, though, are sure to get a thrill getting up close and personal with some of the creatures that call Bays Mountain home. And you can get up close very, and very personal. Close. <laughs> yeah, our Casey Marler traveled inside the more than 40 acres of animal habitats to show us all it has to offer. Dozens of animal species call the Bays Mountain Park home, giving those young and old a first-hand look at how they live in their natural habitat. We have uh, several native animals, uh, f animals that are from this area on exhibit here, like the bobcats that we're, we're looking at right now, the uh, white-tailed deer. We also have gray wolves. Uh, we have raptors, we have a, uh, a herpetarium here which houses our uh, reptiles and amphibians. The two Bobcat brothers, Carter and Cash, are the newest members of the park. Compare that with the red tail hawk, the oldest resident, who's called Bays Mountain Park home for 23 of his 24 years. It is a zoo setting, but we exhibit animals that are from this area instead of animals that are from overseas. Bob Kohler has spent 30 years as a ranger at Bays Mountain Park. He's watched the park and opportunities grow over those three decades. When I started in 1990, uh, one of the big things that's changed over the years is the number of visitors that we have. When I started here, we were getting around 100, 100 120,000 people a year, if I recall correctly, and, and uh, we've more than doubled that over the years. More people means more things to see and do, like Lilypad Pavilion, which opened in 2018. More upgrades are on the way. We are planning on adding a new state-of-the-art otter habitat. I think many people have experienced our old otter habitat um, that has been here for many years and it served us well for many years, but it's time for something new. Through the additions and changes, one constant has remained, education of the world around us. We have school children that come up here and we do uh, educational programs on various animals that we have here and also uh, various um, uh, nature related concepts like ecology ensuring the popularity of Bays Mountain Park for generations to come. The, the support of the visiting public has really helped us to, to maintain what we have, but also to increase the uh, opportunities that we have for educating. Casey Marler, News Channel 11, ABC Tri-Cities.